I'd throw the flag if I was New England. Not in time. Goff to Cooks, and Gilmore throws him down. And again, the Rams are trying to do a little officiating on the sideline on that tackle. Goff has not completed a third down throw. Now 0 for 6. Gilmore bats it down, denying Cooks. It's just too good. He, he's been doing this all year. Cooks runs a good route, but there's really just nowhere to throw that ball. I mean, Gilmore's running the route with him. He's been this way for the last half of the year, Jim, you called it, to have a lockdown corner. Ball on Anderson, races outside. Gilmore, he step off, balls out, and it goes out of bounds. Oh, as he delivered a stiff arm, the football was left behind. This is, this is it, two tight ends, and you just hand off, now cut and bounce outside. That's how you gotta run the ball. And wow, Gilmore with a perfect punch to get that ball out. And that really is fortunate for the Rams. Well, you know they're taking shots down the field now. Blitz to the end zone, and it's intercepted at the three-yard line. Gilmore jumps up and grabs it. The whole game to send it, and Gilmore wasn't going to get beat deep, waiting for the big-time interception. Interception, we say cover zero or all-out pressure. Well, the back can only take one of these two guys. That means that cover zero or all-out means we can't block everybody. Goff knows it, he's got to throw it. And it was shocking, and you see the reaction from the Kraft family, and they know how close this is right now.